and inspiring. Mm -hmm. And you are mm -hmm. really, you, you, you are connecting to an underserved community. A lot of the African American community there is in trouble and you're there to help. Mm -hmm. So I'm all for free speech, but when you wear that hat, which is a symbol of Donald Trump, I don't understand why that isn't a mixed message because Donald Trump has not been a friend of the black community and in many ways has done things that a lot of people consider racist, calling Maxine Waters dumb, calling Don Lemon dumb, calling LeBron dumb, calling Obama dumb, talking about countries and on and on. You know, at a point, I get the free speech issue, but doesn't, doesn't that work against what you're trying to do? Well, my culture definitely is hip hop, you know, because that's something that we made up. Now, Russell Simmons, Dad, what's good? <laughs> Thank you for being here. So, my culture is, um, my culture is hip hop, right? And hip hop, we could take the word, um, we could take the word bitch. We can make anything that someone you know, considers to be negative and make it positive. Energy, you can take it and make it positive. How do you make Donald Trump's statements positive when he talks about, you know, embracing white nationalists, embracing people like David Duke, um, coming down on Colin Kaepernick, saying these sons of bitches should be fired? I don't see he's done anything good for the black community, and frankly, nothing but harm. I don't understand how it's not a mixed message. Well. Think hard, Kanye. Real hard. Do you feel people can grow? Yes. For for someone to grow, they need to know that they got love. That someone loves and someone is leading with love or a group of people are leading with love. There's no way to start a dialogue with you. That's not how you lead with love. But he's been on this on, on this path for years now, um, where people have criticized it, and he has just amped it up. So well, at a point, yes. don't you say he is? Who he is? No, no. What is that? What is that about? This is where the interview gets a little crazy, guys. Yeah. So. Think about it, Kanye. With love, you could... People never are just at a place where you say, excuse me, the guy in a white shirt, I'd like him to move to the, the side because I'm feel, feeling this lady's energy over here. And she is been, feeling her energy, guys. Power and giving me strength in this interview, you know, the entire time. So I need to have this channel connected to her. It's a, she's a beacon of strength for me in this interview. Um, the, um, you want me to repeat? No. Well, why don't we do this? Let's take a quick break. Um, no, when we no, come back, no, we're no, gonna no, 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 we're not gonna Jimmy Kimmel the situation. No, we're gonna come right no, back. No, no, we're not gonna come right back. Okay. We're not gonna Jimmy Kimmel the situation. Fair enough. We're gonna give me time to think. Okay. Mm. Fair enough. You ask me a serious question, and I'm gonna take some time to think about my answer. I'm gonna use time to my advantage sure. in this situation. Mm. Now repeat the question. <laughs> Donald Trump has been on a path <laughs> that has been unrelenting, and if anything, he has amped up um, uh, feelings that seem by many to be racist, that he has not done anything good for uh, the black you're not, you're not giving a question, you're giving opinions. Well, no, but the, but the question is, you, you had said that people have a, uh, the ability to grow, and what I'm saying is, at a point... Yeah, what you're saying. So now I'm waiting for a question for well, me. My point is, at a point... Yeah, that's you your, up, no, that's your point. Do I'm you not, give I, up on the we're, growing? No, we're not, we're not making a point. You're going to ask me a question. Do you give up on somebody growing when they are unrelenting at a point and, when you say they are and, who they are? And I love it. Now you ask me the perfect question. You set me up to win. We never give up on anyone. He's serious. We never give up on anyone. 
now let me even make that more positive we move forward we give love we keep going we keep having the conversation and till the conversation turns to love we keep going i've been calling colin this morning reaching him so i can bring colin to the white house and we can remove no no kanye no kanye he doesn't want to come kanye page no he doesn't want to go does, you, doesn't you, want to go to the White House. Do he doesn't fuck with your president. Yeah, no. Nope. I don't want to fear. Well, like, the thing is, fear keeps you protected, but I don't move in fear. I move in bravery. Sure. I move in courage. Do you mm-hmm. think, in the process of trying to change Donald Trump, he can do a lot of damage to the African American community, to the gay community, to women? Um, do you think that is a real possibility that he could do serious damage by the time he's gone? The universe is on our side, and things will be better. That was a good end. So basically, guys, this whole interview, this whole sit down with Kanye West was about the album being delayed, which he said he's not really finished all the music that he wanted to put up there, so it was going to come out on Black Friday. This interview was about the SNL skit, and... They thought the SNL staff bullied bully Kanye West, but like he said in the interview, I, I didn't catch that. I just wanted to catch this little part because I felt it was a little weird. So what he said was, he said, it wasn't SNL staff. It was the people in his camp. The people that was around him was the ones that was bullying him. That's how he felt in that time. But that hat, and the SNL skit and the album is why this sit down happened today. And actually, after this interview was over, Kanye West went and did a whole goddamn video in the backyard of TMZ. Crazy. But this is Kanye West. And, it, and it's funny how they promoted it because they promoted it in the interview and it's called We Got Love. The video, the, 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 the song is called We Got Love. And all they talking about in this goddamn interview was love. He promoted this this video in his album so good that y'all ain't even peep game. But you know how Kanye West is. We love to hate him at this point. And I just love him. But that's what it was about. I'll come back later. I'm doing my hair right now, but I just had to put this little bit on my page because it was crazy. So, like I said, I'm Eve the Weave. Like, share, and subscribe. Let's talk about the interview. If you've seen it, it's on TMZ. You can go to the TMZ website and watch the whole interview. It's basically damn near an hour long. He took up all the time. And let's talk about it in the comments. I'll see y'all later, guys. Bye.